No road cleaning duties to worry about, just a smooth feel of tarmac and the odd concrete here and there for world champion Sebastian Auger. And he was determined to make it count among the famous Mosel vines. A slight miscalculation early on, but unlike Finland, no major damage this time. And certainly nothing compared to the luckless Yari Mati Lapla yet again. Gearbox problems this time. His challenge over in the first stage on the opening morning. Just not the Finn season. Much better for the third Volkswagen of Andreas Mikkelsen. The Norwegian going well. Taking advantage of OJ's slip to assume the early lead. An eventful season continued to be just that for Hayden Padden. Coming up, one of the biggest moments, not just of this rally, nor this season, but evidently of his career. Very close shave for the New Zealander, but he and co-driver John Kennard could afford to smile. Andres Mickelson did everything he could to stay in contention, a little bit too much towards the end of the rally. Norwegian's hopes of a podium finish at least ultimately going up in flames. Or at least his brakes did on Sunday. And that left Hyundai pair Danny Sordo and Thierry Neville in an extraordinary shootout for second and third places. Ouais. Neville, first to finish. Just safely through the power stage. But this was close between him and Sordo. In fact, it could hardly be closer. The Spaniard crossing the line one tenth of a second quicker overall to snatch second place. The bill could only smile, sort of. Out in front, a long-awaited return to the top step of the podium for Sebastian Auger and Julian Ingracia. And a winning send-off for the departing team boss, Jos Capito. Heading for Formula One. Your expert overview of the entire rally. Get WRC Plus with live GPS map tracking now.